Good morning, friends. It's so good to see you. We're excited to do yoga with you again today, right, honey? Are you excited? Yeah. Today, we're going to do some yoga fun and games. So we're going to do our regular warm up. And then we're going to do some fun games. We're going to do balancing game and we're going to do the balancing is more like a balancing challenge. So we're going to do a balancing challenge and then we're going to do toga, which is like one of my favorite yoga games. We play it in class like all the time. So what you have to do for toga, you just need to make sure you have some pom poms or some cotton balls so that you can pick them up with your toes, right? Yeah, it's, it's so silly and so fun and we love it so much. So let's get started. We have today whoop, whoop, our breathing bowls, right? Whoop, 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 whoop. So when you breathe in, you open up the ball. That's right, just like your lungs are opening up, getting ready to take in all that wonderful air. And when you blow out, you close the ball, just like your lungs are pushing the air out to make room for new, fresh air. When you do that, it gives you lots of good energy and gets your body ready to work. Do you want to trade? We can trade. In class, we like to pretend that this is something yummy baking in the oven. So let's do, since it's morning time, let's do blueberry muffins. Ooh. I can't pick. Good. I can't pick myself and I can Okay, I'm going to do blueberry muffins. Okay, so let's smell our blueberry muffins that just came out of the oven. Big breath in. Oh, but they're too hot to eat, so you gotta blow them out to cool them off and take a big bite. Good job. All right, Hattie, what are you making? Um, poop carrot. Oh, silly. Carrot cake. All right. Let's take a deep breath in and smell that carrot cake. But it's too hot to eat, so you gotta blow to cool it off. Take a big bite. Now you think, what are you gonna make? Good idea. So we're going to smell that. It smells so good, but it's too hot to eat. So you got to blow to cool it what off. Is it? What 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 did my friends choose? I don't know. Our friends chose whatever was in their imagination. All right. Now we took three big breaths. I think we're ready to get started with our favorite song, which is... Yoga Club! We love it so much. So, 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 so much. Ready? Uh -huh. cool. We can do it on the speaker for now. Stretch out your arms. Really, really, really wide. Here we go. Here we go. Tick tock. A little yoga clock. Good job. Tick tock. Am I going too fast? You gotta go regular speed, right? Tick tock. Little yoga clock. Oh, that's your You're not even moving. Show us how to go then. Oh, no one breathe. Good job. Reach down and wind up those toes. Tickle, tickle, tickle. Good job. Come on up, wind up those knees. Come all the way up and wind up your knees. Good job. Now wind up your buttons. Wind up your nose. So good. All right, and now. We're gonna go super fast. Here we go. Go. Faster. Go. Faster. Go. Faster. 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 Up and down, up and, and down. Hair, scratch, 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 scratch. Good job. One more time. Super slow motion. Here we go. Patty Mae, we're doing yoga class. Here we go. Tick. Whoa. So slow, friends. So slow, hats. Holy cow. Oh my goodness, are you moving? I can't tell. You're going so slow. Going slow takes lots of control, right? Super hard. And quick tick tock, tick tock, tick tock. Mama, I did it. Mama, watch this, Mama. Good job. Watch this. Watch what? 
Oh, whoa, legs too, that's tricky. All right, we're gonna do the song that we learned uh, last week, our dance, freeze, melt. That one's really fun. We had a really good time with that one, didn't we, honey? I thought we did. So we're gonna do that one right now. So get ready. Get ready. And I don't know why. Okay, here we go. Job. That one's really fun, right? It's quick and easy. Get your body moving. We love it. Well, it's our new favorite find. All right, now we're going to do sun salutations. I don't know if you remember our sun salutation song from class, but we're bringing it back and we're excited. Here we go. Here we go. Ready, set. Now reach up, up, up to the sun. I reach up, up, up. stretch. Stretch. Up, up to the sun. So good. Ready, set, now hang down. Good job. Ragdoll pose. Or melting pose, right? We just melted like this. Great job, friends. Good job. Touch the ground. Keep one leg by your hands and stretch one leg back. Here, I'll turn to the side. There we go. Good job. Grasshopper pose. Bounce that back leg up. Boing. 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 Good job. Push two. What's this, Hattie? Downward job. Good job. Bottom top. Wag your tail. Rock, 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 rock. Good job. Come down to your belly. Smell some pretend flowers. Ooh, I smell roses and peonies and irises. Ah, choo! Push into our cobra snake. Can I hear you hiss? So good friends, so 
so, so, so amazing and good. All right, so let's see. Let's start with toga. You want to do toga first? Toga is so fun. Heidi, can you go get the pom-poms? So toga is just what it sounds like. It's yoga for your toes. That's right. So we are going to use, whoops, we are going to use pom-poms. We got a big bucket of pom-poms, but you can also use cotton balls, or you can even use anything small that you can pick up with your toes. And so we're going to practice using our toes, kind of like a monkey, right? Monkeys eat bananas peek -a -boo, with their toes. All right, so here's what we're going to do. I'm going to put some pom-poms out on the ground. We have a big bucket, so we're not going to do all of this. And what we're going to do, so you can start by sitting down. You're going to take your toes and squeeze them, so bend them down, and then point them up, and then bend them down, and then point them up and then bend them down and then point them up. Good job. So that's how you're gonna wanna work those toes. So you're gonna squeeze the pom-pom with your toes and drop it either in a circle or a bucket or any spot, a piece of paper. If you wanna make this a color activity, you can match the pom-pom colors with colored paper. Lots of different ways you can do this. Then when you're getting comfortable, I want you to stand up because we're gonna work those tummy muscles, those core muscles, and we're gonna balance and we're gonna squeeze the pom-pom with our toes and hop, whoop, I dropped it. That happens, that's silly. And then drop it in. You can try crab pose, right? Bottoms up, reach for your pom-pom, and then crab walk, whoo! It's hard to crab walk with one foot and drop it in our hoop. All right, sound good? Here we go, all right. So, Hattie, you don't get to sit right there next to it right all right so here we go all right all right actually let's move it back here you can't see me too close to the camera all right so let's start how you start on your foot good I job squeeze. I, I, I want to take that off for a while. okay here you go happy to share there we go i got a big pink one in my toes i'm gonna see if i can hop on one foot and drop it in. Ta-da! Good job! Daddy's walking, walking. walking on one foot. That's okay. This takes a lot of concentration to be able to get it in your toes. That's really, really tricky. Good job. Good job, Hats. Good job. Oh, thank you. Mommy's going to do it from sitting now. Good job. I'm going to lift my feet up and sit it and drop. So fun. So fun. Good job. How are you doing, friends? Are you getting them all? Um, are yelling? Show your friends. We have colorful pom-poms. They're like three different colors. They're so, so fun. Another funny thing that you can do is you can stick them in between your toes. How many pom-poms can you fit? in your fancy little toes. Oh, I have three right now, that's so funny. And I'm gonna cross my leg over and wiggle my toes. Wiggle, wiggle, wiggle. Wiggle, wiggle, wiggle to get them all out. Good job, it's so tricky, right? Mommy, this is one for you. Thank you. Hattie, can you get a big one and put it in the circle so our friends can see? Good job, how are you doing, friends? This is so fun. I wonder what are some other ways that you could do it. Hmm. What's another way you could do it, Hattie? How about I'll pick it up with your hands? Well, you could pick it up with your hands, but then that would be I don't know how to I don't know how to make hand yoga. That would be hand yoga. What's what could we do with our toes? What's another way we could do it with our toes? Could you take maybe put it in between your two big toes? Like this and use both feet together. Whoa, that's really tricky too. And see if you can turn your body and drop it. Can you try that, honey? Come sit. I want to show you. I bet you can. Can you can you come sit? Look, it looks like Caddy wore pom-poms on her skirt today. They're just polka dots. But we dressed the part. Alright, hey, sit down. I'm gonna show your friends. Can you sit, please? Hattie, sit. Please sit down. I love your dance moves. Please sit down. Can you please sit down? There we go. All right. 
feet. So we're gonna take Caddy's and take both of her feet, and she's gonna pinch them together with her big toes. Whoop! <laughs> Ready? Squeeze your feet together. Good. Now try and move it into the circle without dropping it. Oh, sometimes we drop it, right? Sometimes we drop it. Couple more. Couple more pom poms. Let us know what tricks you did with the pom poms. I want to know new ways to do toga. Here you go. Wiggle, wiggle. Let me see. Oh, good job. Wiggle, wiggle. Yes. Wiggle, wiggle. Lots of wiggling. Lots of wiggling. Good job. Good job, friends. Well, that was silly, right? We did a workout for our toes, but it's so fun. And you can do lots of different balancing poses with that. Lots of different ways to try it. Like I said, you can sort them by color. Can you help me pick up, please? Sort them by color. You can do numbers, one pom-pom in one spot, five pom-poms in another spot. Lots of different different things and ideas you can do with those. Okay, now we're gonna practice some balancing. So we're gonna so use, uh, we're gonna do some balancing poses, right? It's a balancing game with our lovies that we use during rest time, during namaste. So you wanna make sure that your stuffed animal is flat on one side, right? We don't want it to be too round or it will roll off your head or your body and then you could get frustrated. Right, and we don't want you to be frustrated. We want to set you up for success. Right, Hattie? Right. Okay, so I have a platypus. Hattie, what do you have? A sheep. So get your animal. And if you have an animal that keeps falling off of your body and you're feeling yourself getting a little mad or a little frustrated, then just pick a different animal, right? Just pick an animal that's a little bit flatter, maybe a little bit smaller, maybe a little bit lighter. No, no thank you. We're not gonna use the baby, you're gonna use your, your sheep, right? Okay? All right, so pick a different animal if you need to and then keep following along. We'll start easy and we'll get a little harder as we go. Okay? Here we go. All right, good job. All right, so have, let's start, oh, how do you use Elmo now? Let's start with it on our head, right? Can you start with it on your head? Good, all right, so let's walk. Good job, Hattie has her arms out. Good job, help bouncing. Backwards, good job. If it falls off, no big deal, right, Hats? Put it back on and try again. Good job, good job. All right, can you do your shoulder? Oh, see if you can keep your ear to the other side, listening to your other shoulder so you're not holding it on, right? Good job. Switch sides. Oh, can you spin? Hattie's balancing in a circle. That's a good idea, Hattie. Boo! Boo! Good job. All right, what about on top of our knee? So instead of tree pose, we're just going to lift our foot up very good and make a nice flat 90 degree line. Woo! With our leg. So it's resting on your thigh. Good job. Hattie's holding on to a toy for balance. And don't forget to switch sides, right? Because we have to do both sides of our body in yoga. Good job, Henne. Good job, friends. All right, let's put it on our foot now. Good job, arms out for balance. Can you lift your foot up? Woo, and down, and up, and down. This one's really tricky. Up, and down, switch sides. Good job. Uh-oh, mine fell off. Mine fell off. You know how to try again, Mom. That's right. I just have to try again. Up and down. Up and down. Good job. Let's come into Cobra Pose and see if we can balance it right on our heads. You think we can? Let's try. So come on into Cobra Pose. Balance it on your head like this. Or your back. Sure. I'm going to do it on my head. Good job. Hattie's going to do it on her back. Hattie, can you get into kitty cat? So from Cobra Pose, whoop, bounce it right off. We're gonna come into kitty cat. Put it right on your back there. Good job. Hattie, can you come to your hands and knees? Oh, okay. So there we go. So you can round your back. Cat and cow move. Cat and cow. Good job. 
from cat, I'm gonna tuck my toes and I'm gonna push my bottom up into downward dog and see if I can keep it on my back. That's a pretty big challenge. Here we go. And woo, good, mind stayed on. Uh-oh, and then it fell off. That's kind of silly, huh? That's so silly, right? You wanna trade? Thanks, Patty. Good training. Good job, friends. Good job. Let's see if we can do, we'll do, one, do more. one more. We're going to do flower pose. So start with the bottoms of your feet together. Take your lovey and put them right on top of your feet. For flower, you take your hands and you hold the bottoms of your calves, right? And then you lean back. Good job. And sit on those sitting bones. The bones are right above your bum. Good, Hattie. And right below your back. Patty's holding on to her thighs. You could do that too if that's easier, but you're still balancing, right? I like that. You can go into with your legs up, right? Good job. Now let's do something tricky. Ready, Hattie? Can you take your lovey in your feet and can you throw it up in the air whoop, and catch it? Oh, good job. Try it again. See if you can throw it and catch it or put it on your lap. Ready? Ready? Whoop. <laughs> I can't. Howdy did it. I'm going to try it one more time. Ready? One, two. Whoop! <laughs> That's another really big challenge. All right, Hattie's going to show one more trick. Oh, good job. Okay. All right, friends. So good today. So good. All right, let's sit crisscross. Good job. Put your hands on your knees. We're going to take our hand. We're going to just kind of stretch it out a little bit before we do our rest. So we're going to put our hand next to our body and we're going to stretch over. Good job. Big breath. <sighs> now, as you breathe in, stretch when you breathe out. Switch sides. Good job, Patty. See what mommy's doing? Can you do what I do? Good job. Breathe in. And then as you breathe out, switch sides. Good job. One more time on the other side. Good job. All right, now stretch your arms in front. I want you to walk, 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 walk those hands as far as you can, keeping your bottom on the ground in crisscross applesauce. This one's tricky. Put your head down, relax that neck. Good job, good job. Can you roll your neck? Are you okay? Roll your neck around and stop. Now roll it the other way and stop. Stretch those legs long and wiggle, wiggle, wiggle. Hattie, can you wiggle, wiggle, wiggle? Wiggle, wiggle, wiggle. Good job. Good job, friends. All right, are we ready for Namaste, Hattie? Hattie, are we ready for Namaste? Yes, we are. Okay, so find, find your lovey. Lammy's right there. You should have for balancing, right? Get comfortable. And here we go. Okay, good job. Oh, put those lovies on your belly and breathe big breaths in and out. Ah, so good, Penny. Penny, anyway, don't press it down. Good job, friends. Addie has ants in her pants today, so we're gonna get going outside uh, and get some energy out, right? I hope you do the same because it's beautiful. And I think 
think it's going to be beautiful outside for the next few days. So get outside, get that fresh air, get those bodies moving. You can do all these yoga activities or both of these yoga activities that we did today outside, which is really, really cool, right? You could try and balance with things you find in nature on your head. You could use acorns for toga. We've done that before. Lots of different things that you could do. Thank you so, so much for joining us today. We miss you all so much. But we hope that you're having fun doing these yoga videos because we're having a lot of fun making them for you. Have a wonderful rest of your week and we'll see you next week. Namaste. The good in me sees the good in you. And you, and you, and you. And you. Say namaste to your friends. <laughs> namaste. Bye, friends. Thank you. Bye-bye.